Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one only, and today we're going to be playing Summoner Quest. This game is kind of Pokemon-ish, and it's online as well, as you guys can see. You can play this on Game Jolt, which I'll leave the description, which I'll leave the link in the description. I try to make a guest account, and the guest accounts don't work, but I'm going to try and see if it'll let me in through this, if I actually create an account. Yeah, okay. It actually lets us in now so guest accounts don't work but login accounts do, do so yeah noted so i wanted to try this game out just because i have not played a pokemon game in like so long and i've been playing all these clones and just been trying them out seeing how they are and jesus christ the sound is like really loud hold on let me turn that down just a bit the hell is this? His face looks so weird. <laughs> so, yeah, this game also doesn't have, like, a full screen or anything. Oh, never mind. I fixed it. This still looks weird for you guys because, uh... Game logic. Let me see if I can fix that. I'm gonna try and, like, stretch out the screen as much as I can here. Nah, I think that's the best you guys are going to get, unfortunately. This game has a weird res to it, apparently. So, I apologize for that. There's nothing I can do for that. I mean, I see it as a full screen. Oh, well, actually, never mind. The way I see it on my screen is exactly the way you guys see it. So, yep, that's the thing. Oh my god, it's a spooter. So obviously it's gonna have like the same Pokemon stuff. You got the battle tutorial. Thing that I didn't know is this game is online. I didn't really realize that. Alright, so you can tag in your monsters. Okay, so I can click that on standby. Most of the I cannot take damage or attack. That are basically just in like their little Pokeballs. It's my command gauge. These numbers showed up. How much command points I have. Wait a minute. Nah, no way. That's definitely not how it goes, right? Okay, never mind. It is not how I thought it was gonna work. I thought it was gonna be like attack until you um, <laughs> attack until you uh, run out of command points. All right, leader attacks. Okay, so there's normal attacks and then there's your skills, and those use your command points. So if you want to use your Skills, you gotta use your pretty much normal basic attack. Yep, our HP pretty much. Tag. I mean, we all know what this Pokemon looks like. Okay, so team assist. Your damage, healing. Ah, okay, so they'll be vulnerable to take damage. Noted. Yeah, I see the yellow gauge. So we got two gauges. So once this fills up, we can have we can use it one time and then we can use it two times. So this one has like way more mechanics than I was thinking. 
so then we would click assist and they have an ability that we can use through the assist. Action. So we choose choose one of them. Okay, we're gonna use Munch. Okay, so Munch heals us. Okay, this game is actually pretty straightforward. <laughs> I didn't... Okay. Never mind. I thought this game was gonna be like really weird to like start recording, but now... Well, that's me with every game I start playing. It's, I just think like, eh, it's not something I want to upload to my channel, but now that I'm getting into it a little bit more... Let's turn it down a little bit. But now I'm getting into it a little bit more. Eh, it's not that bad. Not a lot of people will like it. I know that much. I want to see the carriage models. That's exactly what I want to see. Alright, let's attack. And I definitely want to see more of the monsters, for sure. That face. I, I hate it so much. So we got through the tutorial. Oh my god, it's almost like a mobile game. Never mind. I thought there was going to be like moving around, traveling, and nope, it's like this, pretty much. That's, that's weird. So here's the quest arena. How would you do this for this game? Got items, teams, inbox. So I'm guessing there's summonings too. Referral to new players and get bonus rewards. Oh, so you fuse monsters together so they can learn new things. Okay. Are there even any other players online? I'm literally the only player that is online. <laughs> ah, that feels bad, dude. We go ahead and get my reward. So clearly this game is not as successful as you guys would think. So, yeah, that sucks for them, dude. Let's see. Any items? I have no items. How much would it take to increase? Okay, so this is basically like a little bit closer to a mobile game than a PC game, but yet it's being on PC, and wow, the game just crashed just by doing that. Oh no, I think we just got an error. Okay, we just got an error off that. So we got a daily egg. Let's see what we get. What's in it? My god, look at him. Right, so there it goes out of character. We just throw in. So what's questing like? <laughs> uh, I hate to call the game terrible, but this is pretty terrible. I thought it was going to be like way more interesting going in, but... I can see why they stopped development for like so long now. What are the prizes? Oh, so we get stars depending on what people do or referrals we give out. I doubt I'm gonna find anyone. Since I'm the only player online, so let's go ahead and do questing. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's that's so bad. To be honest, they actually could have pulled off like an actual world where you walk around and actually pick out like these monsters and stuff. See, that would have been like way better for a Pokemon style game like this. People don't like the whole normal, hey, just click and go through quests, fight, 
this, fight that. Yeah, don't think that was the right approach for this game, definitely. Which sucks because they could have had something really interesting going. Uh, I guess I found an egg. Let's go ahead and hatch it. I think I'm gonna skip this one. Oh, we got a slug mode. Let's go ahead and put him in a party then. I at least think they have like little interesting monsters, but. Uh, if they sharpen the graphics a little bit, it would be a lot better because it looks a little bit low res. Let's just say that. Yeah, a little bit low res. This turbo mode. Oh my god, you have to get through it in shop. What the hell is it? Yeah, I'm good. So we just keep going in here and fighting, then we just keep getting eggs and getting lucky, depending on what we get. Yeah, definitely not the best take on this. I would have to definitely call this terrible. Definitely has potential, that's the thing. They just need to change their approach of the game. I mean, I'll give them this. I praise them for making their own models and not just reusing the Pokemon models like every other game has done. Which you can't deny that they've done. Every last clone <laughs> has just straight up done it. Okay, we're missing a lot. Just because of our freaking accuracy going down. Oh, my accuracy returned to normal. Then can I actually kill, please? about to say jeez but yeah I don't really think there's much more to show off with this game considering how dead it is and considering how pretty much uninteresting it is so yeah there are no current bounties because the developers I don't think are working on this game any further I'm pretty sure that's just from my standpoint of what I see on game Jolt. they haven't really updated anybody or anything no new players have come by and commented on game Jolt. so I was just thinking let's give this game a try and kind of regretting it right now but, yeah, you guys pretty much seen everything this game has to offer at this point. So, oh wow, you can buy the, <laughs> you buy some stats too. I guess that's cool. But, yeah, that's pretty much all there is, guys. So, yeah. <sighs> Hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> It's been a while since I played a terrible game, and peace out. <laughs> wow, what a experience. to lose.